Hey, y'all. Okay, so we sitting watching our TV last night, and we saw those debates. Yes. And, you know, I got to talk about it. I got to start going on ahead, just getting them off one by one. Check. <laughs> okay, so let's start with the first one. Okay. Ted Cruz. Ted. You know, Ted tried to come after Donald last night. Uh. Oops, but it didn't work. No. But guess what? Why? We found something out about Ted. Mm -hmm. Now, I back to one of his first debates performance. Yeah. And it was a performance because he's just like Marco Rubio. Uh -huh. A stone robot. <laughs> but here's what he said. What did he say? Ted Cruz said, if you are looking for someone to go to Washington to go along to get along, uh -huh. uh, to agree with career politicians uh -huh. in both parties who get in bed with lobbyists and special interests, then I ain't your guy. Oh, now that's what oh. Ted said. Yes, sir. Oh. <laughs> But Ted, Ted, he didn't tell everybody mm -hmm. that he's in bed mm -hmm. with these special interest groups. Uh -huh. You're in bed with these oil companies. Yes. And what about those two gay guys that you accepted money from? Uh -huh. That's rolling in the hay with them. Sounds right. You're not supposed to be doing that because you said mm -hmm. these are all interest groups. And what I can't understand is you so you are supposed to be so conservative, mm -hmm. a conservative Christian. Uh -huh. And with one hand, he's saying one thing. Yeah. And with another hand, he's taking money mm -hmm. from people and he opposed of their lifestyle. Huh. Shame on you, Taz. Shame. So when I look at you, you're nothing but a liar mm -hmm. and a, 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 a hypocrite. hypocrite. I call him a pathological lying hypocrite is what you are. So when you look at yourself, yes. what you do, when you look at the mirror, you tell yourself, I am a lying hypocrite. That's what you are. A lying, lying hypocrite. hypocrite. Okay. A lying hypocrite is what mm. you are. And maybe you should Google yourself Google. and find out some stuff about yourself mm. so you can stop lying to yourself and thank you lying to us and tricking us because you not. Okay? Oops. Got him out the way. Next. Jeb Bush. Jeb? You know, Jeb said people was, he is tired of people coming out to his family. Uh-huh. Jeb? Jeb? We not coming out to your family. Mm -hmm. We talking about your brother, which is a family member, which is George Walter Bush. Uh -huh. Your brother had this whole country in the economic crisis. Yes. Up under your brother, people that had homes worth $300,000, it the, the, the homes end up falling to about being worth $98,000, fooling around with your brother. Huh. Then 9-11 happened on your brother watch. Mm -hmm. Listen, you Bushes, we don't want another Bush in the house. No. Y'all are destructive, destructive. Disruptive. disruptive. You gonna have us in a depression. depression. And if we give you, Jeb Bush, the keys to the White House, you ain't gonna do nothing but go in that White House and create another war so that you can take have money coming in to go towards your family dynasty. Hmm. And that's why we don't need another Bush in the house. No, no, no. So when you talk about Donald Trump, yes. or when you come for Donald Trump, yes. watch out, Jeb. Watch out. He's going to come for you. Hmm. And what I don't understand is why is it Jeb Bush think that he can beat Hillary Clinton, but you can't even beat Donald Trump? Uh -uh. It, it's strange. Yeah. Jeb, go somewhere and sit down. Please. We don't want you today. No. We don't want you tomorrow. No. We don't want you next year. No. We don't want you when hell freeze over. No. We not gonna ever, no. ever, 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 yeah, ever, 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 ever want another Bush. Nope. Boop. Marco Rubio. Marco. He was still robotic. He was still robotic last night. And Kasich, a man that I will never vote for and the people shouldn't vote for. Nope. And you know our man Donald J. Trump won this hands down. Yes. He won this hands down uh -huh. because the audience was filled with lobbyists and donors. They so they was actually controlling the debate uh -huh. by uh, booing mm -hmm. and doing the things that they do. Mm -hmm. But Donald Trump had held his own. He, sure he did. didn't waver. No. He didn't back down. No, and did. he got everybody on that st stage straight. And that's what we love about him. Yep. That's why he won the debates. And, and if you all got something to say about Donald J. Trump, yes. be cautious. Because when you come for him, mm -hmm. he will come for you. And that's our take on last night's debates.